Hello everyone, welcome to today's video and in today's video I'll be talking about how you should answer the question what is the difference between role and profile. Um, see, most of the time in a Salesforce interview you need to make sure that if you know the answer of a question you're answering it in a, in a proper manner. Okay, because uh, you know there will be questions which you will not be able to answer. So the questions which you know you should answer perfectly so that it increases your chances of getting selected right so the difference between role and profile is a very very important question you may not get this question directly like tell me the difference between role and profile uh, it could be asked in a different different manner like it could uh, be in a situational manner or it could be in a different way like what is the difference between sharing rule and, and permission set what is permission set or uh, what is profile what is role what is uh, criteria based sharing so any any kind of these questions comes in this category uh, the difference between role and profile and whenever you have to answer you need to answer it very uh, properly so and how i normally answer it is that okay whenever we talk about the difference between role and profile the roles comes under the record level access whereas a profile comes under the object level access okay when we talk about the object level access we have two options profiles and permission sets the best practice is that we start with the profiles and uh, give the minimum uh, permissions on the profile and keep increasing those permissions via different different permission sets depending on who need those kind of access. When we talk about the record types, uh, record level access, we talk about the roles, we talk about the sharing rules, we talk about the manual sharing, we talk about the OWD. So these are, you know, uh, comes under the record level access. And you also need to make sure that you know all these things. So if you're saying that OWD, you should know OWD in and out in a way that you're putting the topics in the interviewer's head that you, you can ask the questions from OWD, you can ask questions from manual sharing, you can ask questions from criteria based sharing apex sharing apex sharing is also a very important question if uh, interviewer throws you sharing and if you know apex sharing you can coin this term in front of interviewer and and if he ask it will be good for you if he doesn't ask this question that there is no harm in coining this term in front of interviewer you are just giving him clues to ask questions from you based on your uh, you know skill set uh, rather than he himself uh, kind of trying to find out which question to ask you're putting words in his mouth so that will increase your chances if you know this uh, the answers of those things so you need to prepare very well before giving the giving the answers and you should make sure that whatever you're saying you know all those things because let's say if you're saying that uh, uh, this can be done by a platform event you should know platform event because next follow-up question could be what is platform event why do we use it Alright, so make sure that you are prepared well before answering and if you don't know anything, don't try to bring that thing in your interview. That's a, that's a no-no situation for you. Thank you.